friends welcome to diamonds coaching today we are going to learn about this vortex mixer vortex shaker what is it uh, how does it work and what's it uh, application so let's begin without any delay this is an apparatus little cute apparatus which is a vortex shaker where we uh, use these kind of small vials uh, to mix the ingredients of uh, or any chemicals or of any experiment we are uh, we are doing or we are carrying so let's begin how does it work so here we switch this on and it has uh, two options like uh, touch on or constant on uh, if we do this touch on then it would work only if we uh, place this vial on it so when we touch this vial it will move because the speed is very slow so that's why it's not moving so let's do it so we are increasing the speed this is the speed control where we can increase or decrease the speed of the rotation or the shaking so another option is constant on this option is constant on this means even if we don't touch this surface still it will work and keep on moving or shaking so see this here we, we are controlling the speed this is the highest speed and this is the lowest speed of this so uh, this is how it works its application is in like uh, wherever in the in the laboratories where uh, where you are conducting any experiments like uh, in microbiology in food technology um, in uh, like for dna isolation we have to mix the uh, sample and the solvent so this this why uh, this surface this uh, vortex shaker is used for that purpose where you can mix the contents of the uh, vial or the test tube so another thing is that if we place this vial here and if we hold this uh, vial from the upper side from here and if uh, and if we start this on so let's see yeah and I'm holding this from upper side. What happens is the uh, the contents of the vial go upside and touch the cap of the vial. But if we if I hold this from the lower side like this, yeah. And if I hold this from lower side, it doesn't touch the cap. It doesn't raise up. So. This is how, these are the two methods how we can hold the vial on this surface so that uh, if we want to mix the pellet from the lower side uh, then you should hold this vial from the lower side and if you want to mix all the contents and then you should hold it from the cap or the upper side. So these are the ways with, with uh, which we can uh, conduct the shaking on vortex shaker or vortex mixer. So this was a, uh, this was a video, little video about how the vortex shaker, vortex mixer works and for what reasons do we use this, what is the purpose of it. I hope uh, you gained an insight about it and you have learned this from this video. I hope this helps to you. Thanks for watching and meet you in the next video. Bye-bye.